you hear the advice time and time again that stretching the muscles um, of your neck and your shoulders is beneficial to try to help to decrease the pain of a headache or a migraine and also try to help to prevent it. But is this the best advice that you could be given? Who here has had endless massages to try to help to decrease the tension of their neck and their shoulders and try to help um, to decrease the headaches and their migraines? I know I have, and I love massages, and it felt absolutely fabulous at the time, but then that, that relieving feeling only lasted for like 10 minutes, 20 minutes, maybe even a day if I was lucky, and then I just felt just as tight as I always did. So for those of you that experienced the same feelings that I did, it's because the muscles of your shoulders actually attach into the top three joints of your neck. And we know that those are the headache and migraine joints, and when they're dysfunctional as they are in those with headaches and migraines, then they're actually tugging on the muscles of your shoulders, which is contributing to the feelings of tenseness. So instead of endlessly rubbing out the muscles and trying to stretch them endlessly, which honestly, when you've done that again and again and again, you know it's not making any difference, then we've actually got to approach it in a different way. We've got to mobilize the top joints, and we've got to get them sitting happier so that they're no longer tugging on the muscles and making them feel tight which is also going to help with your headaches and your migraines because when those joints are sitting better, then that helps with your headaches and your migraines. So instead of endlessly trying to stretch them out, which yes, can feel nice, but is it really like the most bang for your buck, then doing mobilization exercises can be more beneficial. So doing things like retractions, so pulling your head backwards and forwards, okay? Doing neck circles. Oh, we love a good neck circle. This also helps to tell you where you're tight, where you're stiff. Don't forget to go in both directions. Going from side to side and also doing TikTok emotions. Love both of those. Okay? So doing these can be really beneficial to help increase the mobility of your neck. It tells you where you're stiff, where you're tight, and where you need to help improve on. A lot of the tightness that you feel when you're doing a stretch down your neck can actually be joint restrictions in the lower part of your neck. And so by doing these mobility exercises, it helps to increase that mobility, increase joint health, and also it can aim to help to decrease those headaches and your migraines. So I'm not saying don't stretch. You certainly can stretch. You can use your spiky ball in through your shoulders. I love that feeling. It's fantastic. But I'm saying that increasing mobility exercises can be more beneficial and adding them into your routine can certainly help in terms of trying to decrease your headaches and your migraines. And I think you'll get some more bang for your buck in doing these. So give it a whirl. Let me know how you go.